Hi, it's Simon here from Gold Coast Solar Power Solutions. Today we have a Schneider Electric Connect RL inverter, and you can see on the screen of this one is we've got the uh, red light on, red error alarm light on, and it's coming up with 2616 isolation impedance error. Now, if you're getting an isolation impedance error on your Schneider Electric inverter, what that's telling you is that there's a problem on the DC side of the system and it's detecting an earth leakage somewhere on the system. Now, an earth leakage problem can, well, it's usually caused by something to do with water, moisture getting into the system somewhere. Uh, not necessarily, but that's what we usually find it to be. It could be water getting into a, a connector somewhere. It could be water getting into an isolator box somewhere or something like that, or it could be damage to some of the cables, something like that. So. If you're seeing the isolation impedance error on your inverter, what I'd recommend doing is just to have a quick once over of everything you can in regards to the system, see if there's any sign of any, uh, any problems there. If you can't see anything, you are going to need to get in contact with your local solar accredited electrician just to try and work out what is going on because they're going to have to, they're going to, have to come out and do some fault finding on the system and work out where that actual problem is. It, it may be with the panels, it, it may be, um, it may even be with the inverter, but usually it's a problem with moisture getting into the system or damage to some of the cables. So look, uh, that's the uh, Connext RL Schneider electric inverter with an isolation impedance error. If you're on the Gold Coast or Southeast Queensland area, uh, area and you've got a problem like this, don't hesitate to get in good touch with Gold Coast Solar Power Solutions. We're certainly happy to help. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it's been helpful for you.